Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to learn about the function in Terraform. So we have already covered the variable in Terraform and now it's time to learn more about function. So let me go through the documentation here. So we have already covered all these things. And then if you see, you come down and if you see there is a topic called function. So there are lots of functions there. If you go to the overview, max, if you want to find out the max, you can find out so max mean there are many many functions are there okay so this is the overview of how you can use the function and i will show you one very good example of lookup function that you can use it with the map and uh, some list and some string functions and some date time functions so whatever the important function is there i will cover and i'll keep visiting this with, with this uh, topic and whenever i will learn anything i will share with you so so in this video uh, my motive is to just how you can use the function and how you can compatible using the function and if you know how to use the function you can you can come here and visit and you can search for which function is useful and you can use it okay so let's go back to vs code okay last class we have learned about the map okay now there is one command called terraform console okay terraform console it will give you the cli cli where you can practice your uh, function so what you can do is let's suppose that you have to find you have to learn about the max so this is max function okay so you we need to find out max of 5 12 and 9 so directly you can write here and it will give you 12 so this is function so again there is some more numeric functions i will just let's suppose that there is a max mean mean is there so mean is also similar okay instead of uh, max you can use mean here mean of 10 12 and 9 okay this is easy things so i will not go deep in this i'll just quickly i will uh, walk you through here this power function you can practice it Okay, this power this 3 to the power 2, 9. Okay, for power 0 is 1. Anything power to 0 is 1 only. So, string functions. String functions, the important thing is uh, you can use join. Join, I have I've already told you in my previous video. Let me just uh, uh, revise quickly. So, join is work on a string. It will take the, the list and convert that into string. So, and let's suppose you have... Uh, list of uh, anything like uh, list of fruits list of employee and you can combine it together and and form one uh, string so you can use join keyword so it is joining the iterator so list is nothing but iterator and uh, whatever the iterator will be there that is list so it whatever the element will be there you can join it with the particular separator, separator here so let me just run this example and uh, come here right click and see here so what did you understand by this you are having foo bar and bars this is the list and it is converting this into string okay so i have given this example in my list topic see here you can you can visit revisit my uh, last last video where i have um, covered the list so you can use it here okay again there is one one more function called uh, hope you understand what the join is so other things is split so split is opposite of join so join what join is do join will convert your list to string and split will convert your string to list okay let me just show you so this is what this is string it will take the string and it will give you list so if you have one list uh, one string if you have one string that is uh, having comma or anything in between so you can separate it you can split it based on that separator okay hope you understand this one it is very easy and i have used this split join lookup all those things my my current project upper so i have just given i'm just giving you one oh, higher level view so that you can just compatible using how you can use it okay 
let me just uh, show you here so see it's giving me list okay so let me just uh, print give me one other example like you have split and uh, my name is uh, smith kumar okay and i want first name and last name both should be there in two uh, places like two variable so i can convert that into uh, list of two element so let me just i will okay first of all um, my variable is what my name is sumit kumar okay so sumit space kumar it is like that i will just write here sumit space kumar so i need to split this sumit and kumar based on space okay so what i will give i'll keep here space okay and comma and here you can give sumit space kumar so what i will get okay i'll get error why because i have i had made some mistake here okay so this is a uh, uh, we have to put uh, double quote here okay no problem split double quote space double quote comma and then sumit kumar you can see sumit and kumar so the list of zero element will be the first name and list of one first element will be kumar so you know how to access the list using index so this is the second example now you can just practice all these things there are many string contents start with and then uh, time there are many upper lower all these things are there so now come to the collection function in the collection we have already learned dictionary is collection okay concat is there what concat function is do is it just concate the list into one list so multiple list into one list so you, we are having two list here a means first list having a and blank and second list having b and c so it will concat this two list into one list we'll get a blanks b and c okay this thing is easy you can practice that's all for this video in my next video we will learn about lookup function so please subscribe to my channel thank you very much